thanks for coming back to my channel. So this is week four slash five of my fitness journey. I want to apologize for being so late in this video. I've had a lot going on and I've kind of come to the conclusion. Oh, by the way, before I continue, I want to say thank you so, 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 so much to all of you who have commented on all of my fitness journey videos. If anything, I expected people were going to be yelling at me like, you're not losing weight fast enough, what's wrong with you, you know, you've got this wrong with you and that wrong with you, and you know, um, you guys didn't comment like that at all. If anything, you guys reminded me um, to focus on my measurements and not necessarily the number on the scale, which I want to thank you for that because it is very easy to focus on that number on the scale and you know that's not a complete accurate reflection of somebody's health per se so you know so thank you and thank you for you know not being mad that I didn't lose 10 pounds this month some of you are probably like why didn't she lose more what's wrong with her you know but if any of you have ever tried to go on a diet before you know how the struggle is especially in the United States of America rather than beat up on myself because you guys have really encouraged me not to beat up on myself because I do have the tendency to you know well who doesn't have the tendency to judge themselves and put yourself down you know I, I'm really happy to say that in the past uh, month since I, I October 2nd I think was the day I started to try to take steps towards a healthier lifestyle since having had a baby but I want to say that I'm proud of myself for having exercised so much this month more than I've exercised in over a year so I'm really thankful for your guys' encouragement with that where I have had the most amount of trouble is well I, I have done a pretty good job with my water I'll say these past few days I've I've been uh, actually today I've been good with my water but for the past couple days like the past few days I haven't been that great but overall for the month I've done extremely well with my water so I'm super happy about that yes I had a bit of a setback you know uh, with my water these past few days but I'm gonna continue and I want to encourage you guys to continue with your water too don't let setbacks keep you from continuing on your journey um, so if you guys have inspired me so if I can inspire you or encourage you in any way then I hope I hope that I can I got injured when I was exercising last week um, this like over here I don't I don't know if it was when I was doing this number like you lay on the floor with weights and then you like I forgot what those are called <laughs> But I don't know what I did, or maybe it was when I was doing this number. I'm not sure, but somehow I injured over here, and it's I like to just to sit up can hurt sometimes. So I tried to exercise yesterday again, and I think I re-injured myself. <laughs> so um, I, I was using weight, weights that were too heavy. I was doing so good with my exercising, and I was like, maybe I can move up in weight. No, no, I, I couldn't. And um, so I need to let that heal. I do have a stationary bike, so I'm going to have to switch to that. And I didn't want to because like, I, I like using dumbbells and I like squatting and doing strength training. And the stationary bike is, but it's really good for you, you know, for your heart and everything. So I, I prefer the weights, but I, I'll do the stationary bike because it's good for me too and, and so that's what I need to do focus on my lower body since this part is not feeling well and just you know these things happen maybe some of you guys have gotten injured before so it was a blow for me I felt kind of depressed about it and I was like whatever you know all my efforts are out the window because you know I can't exercise and I was doing so good at my exercise so I was happy about that but then to have that kind of taken from me with an injury where even doing jumping jacks was hurting because just lifting this was hurting me. So 
Um, so it was, it was a, a blow, and I don't know if you guys have ever experienced that, where maybe you were all into running, and you were so proud of yourself for running, and then you injured your leg, and then it's like, now what am I going to do, you know? So the stationary bike, you know, it's kind of hard, like, if I, it was kind of like if I couldn't do that, then it was nothing, but, you know, you got to do sometimes your, what you can, and that's something that I can do. And I think somebody on here on YouTube mentioned that that's what they're doing. So I'm going to be joining you in that for the next few weeks until I am totally healed up. So did I lose weight? No, I actually went up a pound point three, a pound point four. So I haven't lost any weight for the month. But like I said, I'm proud of myself for starting to eat better vegetable. At least the quality of my food has changed. Yes. Can I make improvements still? Totally. Totally. I think you saw that I was eating like sodium foods on the last weeks or the couple weeks ago. I was eating like sodium packed foods and I needed to quit that. So I cut back on the sodium a little bit. But like I said, I wasn't exercising. So I was kind of depressed about that. And I wasn't eating as well as I could have this past week and I haven't weighed myself today just because I was in such like a depression kind of thing <laughs> about it and you know I'm trying to suck in and you know look good on camera but I'm not even wearing the weight uh, that little outfit the workout outfit which is from Old Navy by the way in case you were wondering where I got that that was from Old Navy I don't know maybe you weren't anyway so but I have to really be thank I, I'm really thankful for the comments you've given me because when I was going through my little mini depression, I was reading what you guys were writing and I was like, Jennifer, look, they're rooting for you. They aren't putting you down and telling you what a loser you are. Granted, they didn't know that I was in a depression, <laughs> but, but um, they're not putting you down. They're encouraging you. Some of you guys were like, saying such sweet things, and um, I just want to say thank you. Also, I want to say my inches have not changed of that I know of. When I, 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 I weighed myself and measured myself last week, and my inches were still the same, even though I gained a little over a pound, I'm really shocked. I think that's because of the exercise that the inches stayed off. So that's another reason um, I want to continue with exercise especially like if anything that motivated me to want to keep exercising because if it can take off the inches then I'm all for that <laughs> without dieting <laughs> I'm all for that but I still I I do want to eat less and I've kind of come to the conclusion that I'm going to need to start watch being more mindful of my portions um, I think some of you saw the video where I went out on the date with my husband at uh, La Hacienda de San, Han San Angel and uh, you know I had a little alcohol there I think later that weekend I had a little more alcohol too well, not like we had bought a bottle of wine so at night we were having a, a glass of wine after Ariana went to bed but anyway I want to do these videos monthly is what I thought about recently. I was talking to Rachel, if you've seen Confessions of a Retired Disney Princess, I was talking to my friend Rachel about it. She was, she understood, you know, um, I, I, I can only realistically do about two videos a week on average. And if one of the videos is for fitness, that leaves me with only one other kind of video that I can do for the week. and. You know, I want to, some weeks, I don't want to do the fitness one. I wanted to do, like, entertainment video type things. And if every week I'm having to do a fitness video, I can't focus on the entertainment. So I didn't really think things through when I started this. But I still want to continue with these types of videos. But I just want to do it, like, once a month. And so, like, do, you know, for the next one, I want it to be for the month of November. And then, you know, one for the month of December. And then one for the month of January. Ideally, I would be doing videos every single day. I would be uploading a video, but for my lifestyle right now, it's just not realistic. So hopefully one day I can do these videos more frequently, um, but for now, I hope you don't mind if these become a monthly thing and not a weekly thing, because it is kind of hard to keep up with everything. 
So even even though I have my parents' help, my mom is here watching Ariana for me. So thank you, mom. Thank you so much, you guys, for all of your positive feedback. I want to encourage you guys to even go above and beyond me and just to, if you have any words to encourage me, um, hard times that you've been through, that you've pushed through, uh, I would love to hear about it. And I look forward to talking to you guys next month and letting you know how I'm doing. And thank you so much. And I'm sorry that I'm not Jillian Michaels. I'm not Jillian Michaels. I wish I was. Thank you guys so much for your encouragement. And I hope you can relate on some level to me. We, as human beings, are so much more than just our physical, outward, you know, so, I think that's important to remember when you're going about your fitness routine, that there's more to us than just our physical. So, if you like this video, please like it. If you want to subscribe to my channel to see more of the videos that I have, I would love that. And if you want to share this video, I would love that too. Thank you so much for watching hugs and love and, and positivity towards you guys. Thank you so much. God bless.